Good evening and welcome to the Warhill High School 2022 commencement ceremony. Thank you, Mr. Inlow and the Warhill Band. For, for your rendition of Pomp and Circumstance. We ask now that you please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance, led by Hannah Butner, Class of 2022 President. Uh, President. Gentlemen, please remove your caps. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. Thank you. Everyone, please be seated. Good evening and welcome to our families, friends, colleagues, graduating seniors, distinguished members of the Williamsburg James City County School Board, distinguished members of the James City County Board of Supervisors, Superintendent Dr. Olwyn Heron, members of the superintendent's leadership team, Warhill High School faculty, staff, and other invited guests. We are excited by your presence to, to honor our class of 2022. My name is Michelle Newcomb, and it is my privilege and honor to serve as the principal of Warhill High School. On behalf of our dedicated faculty and staff, I welcome you to this graduation celebration of the class of 2022. Congratulations, seniors. The faculty and staff. <laughs> the faculty and staff of Warhill High School are proud of you and your accomplishments. During your tenure at Warhill, you have won various state, regional, and national awards. The class of 2022 has amassed $8,013,295 in scholarships and awards and recognized, <laughs> and recognized one WJCC Honor Program graduate and two National Merit Scholarship Commended graduates. Additionally, your hard work and achievements have prepared you for exciting opportunities ahead, including entering the workforce, serving in the military, enrolling in technical schools, as well as two and four year colleges and universities. I would like to take the time to thank our parents and families for your partnership. Your support at home and in our school has given us the opportunity to work with outstanding students, and your encouragement has led us all to this special day. At this time, I would like to introduce the platform guests. I will ask each guest to stand when recognized and remain standing until all guests are introduced. Dr. Olwyn Heron, WJCC Superintendent of Schools. Mr. Greg Dow Jr., WJCC School Board Chair. Ms. Sarah Ortigo, WJCC School Board Member. Dr. Katherine Worley, Assistant Superintendent. The Honorable Michael P. Mullen, Virginia Delegate, 93rd District. Mr. John McLennan, Chairman, James City County Board of Supervisors. Ms. Ruth Larson, James City County Board of Supervisors. And our Warhill High School Administration, Dr. Chantel Cook, Assistant Principal. Ms. Danielle Gish, Assistant Principal. Ms. Mia Pollard, Assistant Principal. Thank you, you may be seated. Finally, I am honored to recognize the amazing group of compassionate and professional educators, the Warhill High School faculty and staff Please stand and be recognized. Without your commitment, compassion, and dedication to your students and our community, Warhill High School would not be the exceptional place for learning that it is today. 
Thank you for your tireless energy, extended effort, personal sacrifice, and your commitment to our school. The class of 2022 has reached this milestone in their lives because of your actions. You are deeply appreciated by everyone in our school community. Thank you. At this time, I will ask that senior choir, orchestra, and band members please make your way to your ensembles for one final performance. It is with great pleasure that I introduce the Warhill High School Choir under the direction of Miss Emily Evans, accompanied by the Warhill High School Orchestra under the direction of Miss Elizabeth Kane. The Honors Choir is an auditioned ensemble consisting mostly of upperclassmen. This year, they performed at Warhill football games, went caroling in the community, and held a collaborative concert with the William and Mary Choir. They earned superior ratings at the VCDA performance assessment on college level repertoire. This ensemble also includes delegates for the district and state level choirs. This year, three students qualified for senior regional orchestra, one student auditioned for all state orchestra, and the honors orchestra received a superior rating on grade level six music at district assessment. The orchestra has played this year at the National Honor Society induction ceremony, senior award night, and the WJCC retirement ceremony. At this time, the choir, accompanied by the orchestra, will perform Irish Blessing. Thank you, Warhill Choir and Orchestra. It is now my honor to introduce the Warhill High School Band under the direction of Mr. David Enlow. Under the leadership of Mr. Enlow, the Warhill Band has continued its tradition of excellence. This year, the Marching Lions took second place in both competitions they entered and earned straight superior ratings at the state marching assessment. Both the Symphonic Band and the Wind Ensemble earned straight superior ratings at the district concert assessment and the Jazz Ensemble earned straight superior ratings at the District Jazz Assessment. The Warhill Band program was named a Virginia Honor Band for the third time in the last five years. 
please turn your attention to the Warhol Band who will perform La Tregenda by Puccini.
Thank you, Warhill High School Band. Tradition dictates that each year we recognize the two students who have earned the highest cumulative grade point averages during their high school tenure. I am pleased to announce Melinda Lindblom as the salutatorian of the class of 2022. <laughs> Melinda is the daughter of Matt Lindblom and Margaret Lau. Melinda, we wish you well as you attend college in Switzerland in the fall. Finally, we are very proud of our valedictorian for the class of 2022. Abigail Diana Pacheco, please step forward. <laughs> Abigail is the daughter of Harry and Catherine Pacheco, and she will attend the University of Chicago in the fall. Abigail and Melinda, we commend your academic pursuit, your many accomplishments, your leadership, your example to your peers, and your commitment to the highest standard of learning and academic integrity. We would like to recognize now a Warhill student whose notable academic achievements resulted in earning the prestigious honors seal on her diploma. To achieve this designation, this student completed diverse advanced placement courses with distinguished achievement on the accompanying college board examinations, a focused foreign language study, significant community services, and an independent honors project. Lindsay K. Hood, please step forward. <laughs> Lindsay's honors project was titled, The Ethics Behind the Evidence. Through extensive research, Lindsay examined the ethical and unethical uses of forensic science in criminal investigations and court proceedings. Congratulations to WJCC Honors graduate, Lindsay K. Hood. Each year, a committee of faculty members review applications from our senior class to select speakers for our commencement ceremony. Please welcome our first student speaker, Mary Ann Packer. Mary Ann will address the senior class and the community this evening with her speech entitled, Starting Now. Alrighty. Good evening, friends, family, and faculty. My name is Mary Ann Packer. To preface, I do have the reputation of being a bit pedantic. And well, if you don't know what that means, pedantic is often used to describe a boring know-it-all. So this evening, I promise to try my best not to embody my pedantic nature. To start, I would like to quote the great philosopher, Kendrick Lamar. In his famous work, Humble, Kendrick says, be humble, sit down, be humble, sit down. <laughs> On a serious note, I believe the advice to be humble resonates well with how we should carry ourselves as we progress into our lives. Being humble does not mean to merely ignore our great achievements, but rather inspires us to embrace them with humility and gentleness. In our culture, which focuses on success, comparison, and competition, we can easily become overwhelmed with feelings of inadequacy. However, no matter if you're first in the class or 300th, you made it here today, and that is what matters. Being humble allows us to stimulate gratitude for the simple fact that we are here. But while we're on the topic of class ranking, I want to take a moment to recognize our incredible valedictorian, Abigail Pacheco. Let's give her a hand. Abby exceeds 
exceeded the expectations in all her classes for four strenuous years. And she will be attending the University of Chicago in the fall. Congratulations, Abby. We are all so proud of you. The main point is that each person here is individually gifted. Whether you plan to go to college, into the trades, into the workforce, or are pursuing other endeavors, you are worthy. With our unique skills, we all have the potential to impact the world. However, we know this is easier said than done. The next stages of our lives are filled with the unknowns, the ifs. I would like to share a poem with you all that my grandmother Cunningham shared with my mom and that my mom passed down to me. The poem is titled If by Rudyard Kipling and a small piece of it goes. If you can dream and not make dreams your master, if you can think and not make thoughts your aim, if you can meet with triumph and disaster and treat those two imposters just the same, if you can bear to hear the truth you've spoken, twisted by knaves to make a trap for fools, or watch the things you gave your life to broken and stoop and build them up with worn out tools. We possess the resilience and determination to make the best of any situation, to use our worn out tools in our dirty coat pockets. Just as Kipling mentions in his poem, we have met with disaster. We endured the COVID-19 pandemic and continue to battle its persisting effects. Yet this disaster led us here, now. This disaster inspired us to better ourselves and band together. We now stand triumphant and with many more triumphs to come. Let us treat triumph and disaster the same in the sense that we continue to collaborate using each of our own talents for the betterment of our communities. I'm so proud of all of us here today. Let us give a hand to our class of 2022 graduates and to the faculty who has supported us through it all. <laughs> to leave off with a bit of motivation, I want to challenge each and every one of you to start now. Starting now, let us be brave and bold in our dreams. Starting now, let us sit down, you already got that one, and be humble. Starting now, let us begin to cultivate our hopes for the future and encourage others to pursue their hopes too. Because after all, we only have this one life, but at least we have each other to share it with. Thank you so much and congratulations, class of 2022. Thank you, Marianne. Our second speaker is Jillian Perticone. Jillian will address the audience this evening with her speech entitled, Life's Fullest Moments. Let me adjust this. I'm a little taller than Marianne. I would like to start today off with some thank yous. Thank you to the teachers, staff, and administration at Warhill for your devotion to us as students. I know we have not always made it easy. Thank you for your patience during the seemingly endless hours of instruction, and thank you for the valuable opportunity to learn and grow. Thank you to the parents, guardians, and other loved ones of our graduates for your support. Thank you for encouraging us and pushing us to be the best versions of ourselves so we could be here today. And lastly, I ask you as graduates to thank yourselves for continuously persevering through all the hardships we have had to endure over these past four years. When I first decided I wished to deliver a speech at this year's graduation, I knew it meant I needed to conduct research. This meant watching and re-watching cheesy 90s and 2000s teen rom-coms and coming-of-age movies to analyze the overly optimistic graduation speech delivered by the movie's main protagonist. It also meant 
trolling the depths of YouTube for real life graduation speakers and analyzing their speeches and deciphering what made their speeches so impactful. I decided I wished to do a bit of both, deliver a speech that was charismatic while also being realistic and offer insight into the future. Given the circumstances of the pandemic, as well as the cultural values of our generation, it's safe to say that high school hasn't been an entirely pleasant experience. And throughout our time as high schoolers at Warhill, we've all needed to make decisions. Because we were young, and we still are, the decisions we've made and the ones we will make haven't been, nor will they be, the best or the brightest. But that's okay. We weren't put on this earth to live the perfect life but it does beg the question, what is life's purpose? Now this existential idea and concept seems far too convoluted to be able to define and distinguish it all, let alone in a five minute speech. So I knew if I wanted to complete this task, I would be resourceful and take to the likes of Google. <laughs> Here I found two main responses. Our first purpose being to love. I did find truth in this response, but it felt too simplistic. Love what? Others? Absolutely. Yourself? Sure, why not? This answer is endearing, but I think there's more to living life than just love. And this would lead me to our second response, one that is more pessimistic. Our purpose on this earth is to survive. While I was taken aback by the statement's boldness, scientifically it was true. I perceived its intentions to be we wake up, we eat, we go to work, we eat, we sleep, and repeat. The problem is that this answer, it immensely oversimplifies the complexity of human nature and its mesmerizing beauty. We deserve more than to spend our time in a never-ending loop of sorrow and blandness, because despite the mistakes we've made and the ones we will make, we deserve more. We deserve to stay up late doing who knows what until the bright lights of morning come, we deserve to laugh until our lungs physically won't allow it. We deserve to love until our hearts are full. And while it would be much nicer and more desirable to say we only experience the good in this life, it's not true. We will feel pain and sadness. We will feel stress so much until we can't bear it. We will feel anger until it seeds into our hearts, breaking down every fiber of our being. And pain. And while we do deserve these things, we need both of them. We have to be able to endure the mind-blowingly beautiful, but also the gut-wrenchingly ugly in order to live this life. Both are necessary. To live this life to its fullest potential means to do more than to love or to survive, but to live. My advice to the graduating class of 2022 is to bask in the pure elation of the highs, but also cherish the pain and sadness of the lows, because it makes the great moments that much greater. Take advantage of every opportunity you are given. Do everything you can to get the most out of this life. Do it so when our time on this beautiful, beautiful earth comes to an end, we can say we lived our lives to the fullest. Thank you. Thank you, Jillian. Our senior class officers will now share a few memories from their time at Warhill High School. Please welcome President Hannah Butner, Vice President Samantha Parker, Secretary Kyleen Valencia, Treasurer Chloe Dalton, and Historian Haley Redden. My name is Samantha Parker, and I am your class of 2022 Vice President. Freshman year, <laughs> freshman year to some may feel like a fever dream. It was strange. All three middle schools combined together with people that you've heard of but never met. You started all over, making new friends, meeting new people that you would spend the next four years with. We would walk through the school thinking that the seniors looked so tall and that they owned the school. We would try to push our way down to the bottom of the bleachers at the football games just to get kicked back because we all knew that freshmen sat at the top. But now we are those seniors at the bottom of the bleachers. 
and the, well, not in my case, tall ones that walk through the hallways. Freshman year was our first year together as a class, and I think we've made a pretty good name for ourselves. Thank you. Good evening, I'm Chloe Dalton. I served as the treasurer for the class of 2022. Sophomore year started our last normal year of high school. Even though our year got cut short with the start of COVID, I think it's safe to say for the class of 2022, we still have memories to hold on to. We had Friday night lights, a fall pep rally, homecoming, and fall spirit week. This was our last taste of normal life. Yet somehow we managed to carry every tradition and more into senior year. The uprising of the global pandemic and our unshakable persistence defined what the class of 2022 will be known for forever, keeping the lion pride alive. Hello everyone, I'm your senior class president, Hannah Butner. <laughs> when trying to explain a time of your life that was most draining, routine shattering, and brain straining, refer to junior year. Most will argue that it is the hardest year of high school, partially because of the academics, but largely because it is the first year we really had to think about our future. The most difficult part of junior year was transitioning back into once, what we once called normal, Tra transitioning from being cooped up inside our houses into the new Warhill with arrows in the hallways, plastic between us and our teachers and filtered clouds over our faces. If you asked us our freshman year what we would do if something like this happened, we would laugh because that year was so unimaginably crazy and life-changing. But look where we are now. We're about to graduate high school. Junior year was memorable for reasons that we never knew were possible, but we'll, we will always be known as that class who didn't let one roadblock hinder our high school experience. Thank you. Hi, I'm Kyleen Valencia, your senior class secretary. Here we are, senior year, looking back on the progress we have made, the bonds we have formed, and the future we have established for ourselves. There isn't a more fitting moment than now to thank the entire Warhill family. Four years ago, we were at the bottom of the totem pole. Now we are about to receive our ticket into the next chapter of our lives where we will once again be at the very bottom of the totem pole. <laughs> I'm Haley Redden. <laughs> I'm your senior class historian. All right. Being at the top dog was fun, however. We were finally able to rule the student section at football games, walk through the halls with confidence, enjoy our own senior week, and of course, conquer the pep rally, starting with our epic senior run-in. All of this was fun, but there is so much more to come up. Up until now, our parents, teachers, and peers have done all they can to prepare us for success in the real world. Now it's up to us to decide if we want to hold on to our values, motivation, and lie in pride after graduation. Congratulations, class of 2022, and thank you. Thank you, Hannah, Samantha, Chloe, Haley, and Kyleen for sharing your reflections on your time at Warhill High School. Now the class of 2022 will initiate the transfer of the senior class insignia to the class of 2023. Please welcome to the podium, again, Hannah Butner and Mackenzie Dean, the president-elect of the class of 2023. Hello again. As the outgoing president of the class of 2022, I hereby present the class of 2023 with the senior class insignia. This insignia represents the high ideals of school leadership in spirit. On behalf of the graduating seniors today, we wish our new seniors happiness and success in your senior year at Warhill.
My name is Mackenzie Dean, and as the incoming president of the class of 2023, I proudly accept the senior class insignia and the many traditions and responsibilities it represents. On behalf of the class of 2023, we celebrate your legacy and look forward to our own exciting senior year at Warhill. Thank you, Hannah and Mackenzie. Good evening again, and to the Warhill class of 2022, congratulations. Over the past four years, you have encountered successes and failures, embraced new opportunities, and experienced a wide range of achievements, all of which have brought you to this special day. It is an honor to share this milestone with you. Kabir Das, 15th century Indian poet, said, wherever you are is the entry point. Well, today, class of 2022, you are here, surrounded by your loved ones and the teachers and staff that have supported you for the last four years. But today's where is not your ending. It is your entry point. Sure, it marks the end of 13 years of hard work, dedication, and persistence to reach your goal. It marks the end of a small but influential part of your life. You have formed friendships, discovered your strengths through a global pandemic, and learned resilience in ways no one could imagine. You've navigated traditional learning, virtual learning, hybrid learning, and back again. But fear not, because these endings have led you to today, your entry point, your entry into the world armed with the skills you will need to find success in your next chapter. You will continue to encounter highs and lows. You will encounter success and failure but you will create new memories and learn many lessons along the way. The good news is that your time at Warhill has taught you how to set goals, to follow through, and to take the steps needed to achieve your dreams. So continue to set high expectations for yourself, seek out new opportunities, make good choices, take time to take care of yourself, and never stop learning. You are here today, but you are entering a world of possibility. It has been an honor to serve as your principal as you closed out your high school career. I cannot wait to see and hear all of the great things you will do from here. Congratulations, Warhill High School class of 2022. We are proud of you. It is now my pleasure to introduce our honorable superintendent, Dr. Olwyn Heron, who will assist with the awardings of the diploma. Thank you, Ms. Newcomb. It is my honor and privilege to celebrate the men and women of the class of 2022. Today is your day. While this is the end of your time with WJCC schools, it is just the beginning of all that is to come. Earning your high school diploma sets you on a path for continued success in both college and the workforce. On behalf of the school board, your teachers, and school leaders from elementary, middle, and high school, I offer you congratulations and wish you every success in the future. Set lofty goals, work hard, and continue to accomplish great things. It is now time to award the diplomas. <clears throat> Ms. Newcomb, do you certify completion of the graduation requirements by the Warhill High School class of 2022? Superintendent Heron, I affirm to you that these seniors before us today have met the requirements for graduation in Virginia. By the power vested in me by the Commonwealth of Virginia, I hereby grant certification of completion of graduation requirements to the students of the class of 2022, and I hereby authorize the issuance of diplomas. Ms. Newcomb, you may proceed. Thank you, Dr. Heron. Now we will begin our distinguished presentation of graduates of the Warhill High School class of 2022. 
Faculty, students, and ushers, please take your places for the awarding of diplomas. <clears throat> Benjamin Stephen Allen. Lexi Ann Amsdale. Christopher Charles Anderson. Cassius Reigns Armour. Kamora Chardé Arnold. Hadia Athalia Arokium. John William Baldwin. Josh Martin Bartlett, Barkley. Jeremy Chase Barnett. Jordan Marie Barrett. Olivia Isabel Batten. Madison Joe Beasley. Seth Warren Beebe. Jacqueline Faith Benham. Emma Joyce Barati. Layla Valine Ann Black. Caitlin Elizabeth Blamo. Gavin Jacob Boysell. David Ernesto Bolenes Jimenez. Caitlin Saya Brewster. Hunter Michael Brickhouse. Carrie Nicole Brenton. Micah Boishong Brisco. Michael Tyler Brownfield. Chase Joseph Bullock. Haley Morgan Burke. Jake Alexander Bynum. Carrie Gregory Caldwell. Benjamin Keith Calfee. Clara Ann Calfee. Elena Christine Carnahan. Taylor Lynn Carter. Thomas Lee Carter, Jr. Evan Bailey Cashiros. 
Cole Austin Chapa. Jacoby Alexander Cherry. Paul Jeremy Clary. LaJayla Lamaya Clemens. Logan Alyssa Klein. Tyler Lloyd Kuhn. Xander James Coger. Haley Danielle Congdon Mitchell. Grace Kelly Conklin. Olivia Claire Connell. Emma McComber Cook. Ryan Nicholas Cook. Kimberly Ann Cottridge. Nathan Liam Cox. Connor Murray Allen Crank. Liel Joseph Kasia Amazon Cristobal. Timothy Kane Dacer. Curtis Ravon Davis Jr. Jefferson Elliott Davis the fifth. Megan Irene Dean. Richard James D'Angelo Jr. William Eduardo Del Cid Carreras. Kayla Alize Delgado. Isabella Andrea Dill. Gavin Cole Dix. Kaylee Jane Dresden. Jalisa Adeja Drummond. Elizabeth Marie Dunn. Hunter Ray Edmondson. Donovan Lawrence Edwards. Nathan Gage Emerson. Dimitri Rose Emery. Catherine Rose Esposito. Xavier Rashad Etter. Mason Alexander Ewing. Rourke Edward Farr. Matthew Sean Ferguson. Joshua Alexander Fernandez. (laughs) 
Amarion Orlando Fields. Lily Noel Ives Freelich. Asia Imari Fletcher. Colton David Fletcher. Ashley Flores. Dixon Fernando Flores Portilla. Emma Loretta Foy. Sean Corey Gaddy. Chasen Alexander Gadigan. Shelby Paige Gaskill. Ian Michael Giesman. Jade Lily Gillis. Caitlin Ann Gomez. Marissa Soledad Gonzalez Wilson. Cyrese Ilani Gonzalez de Jesus. Charlotte Francis Gravel. Allison Sophia Gray. Logan Patrick Gray. Andre Anna Torre Renee Green. Brianni Ariana Green. Beautiful Morning Griffin. Caitlin Elizabeth Griffin. Jillian Ruth Elizabeth Grossman. Michael Murphy Haddock. Niasia Anaya Harvey. Maxton Anderson Hassel. Lucas James Heck. Peyton Nicole Hurstbold. Xavier Charles Berry Hill. Jaden McKee Hilliard. Heidi Lynn Hillstrom. Rhiannon, Rhiannon Gabriella Heim. Quincy Russell Heinrichs. <laughs> Kelly Ann Hipple. <laughs> Car
Carter, Huntington, Kalik, Kalik, Ka, excuse me. Sorry. Carter, Huntington, Kilforth, Hoff. Kalila Charlize Holder. Samantha Nicole Holsworth. Claire Suzanne Holman. Luke Thomas Holmes. Rashad Lashane Holmes. Janari Adanya Holmes Connor. Olivia Claire Holt. Emily Ryan Hoberg. Jackson Terry Howard. Abigail Grace Hernser. Elizabeth Faith Hernser. Madison Gray Hudson. Haley Alyssa Hughes. Elena Marie Ingram. McKenna Jordan Jackson. Brock Edward Jefferson. Joshua Tremaine Jefferson. Isaiah Terrell Jefferson Jr. Trevor Jacob Jeffries. Serena Kasara Johnson. Satya Janae Jones. Mary Elizabeth Jordan. Layla Elizabeth Joseph. Lily Keeler. Matthew Walker Keithley. Elena Bianca Kelly. Brennan Thomas Kelso. Ethan Alexander Kimmel. Tori Allison King. Ryan James Korbeck. Nicolette Kata Cormos. Samuel Scott Lang. Ian Kalum Lathers. Mackenzie Marie Lavender. Rachel Elizabeth Lawson. Benjamin Mark Lee. T. 
Tiana De De Dejanay Lee. Caitlin Stephanie Leak. Jaina Marie Leak. Sean Robert Lehman Jr. Amari Danielle Lightfoot. Kaylee Jessica Ligon. Ryan Kenneth Lindley. Casey Ray Lovelace. Haley Kate Lowry. Sophia Isabel Macias. Hannah Paige Madden. Brooklyn Renee Manley. Chase Nicholas Manns. Caleb Michael Miramont. Kylie Ray Martone. Evan James Massey. Raymond Christopher Bonta McAdams. Sean Patrick McCaffrey. Megan Grace Ann McClatchy. Alexis Danielle McCoy. Antoinette Isabel McDade. Shemaya Alexandria Danae McKenzie. Ashley Grace McLean. Layla Rose McLean. Caroline Elizabeth McWhorter. Cassidy Lee McWhorter. Alana Sophia Mead. Brooke Mackenzie Mead. Sean Anthony Mendiola. Miles Luis Mercado. Joseph Edward Metivier. Julie Ann Mativier. Hunter Lanier Mickelson. Amber Michelle Middleton. Darian Thomas Middleton. Jeremiah Charles Mahalko. <laughs> Kenneth Reed Milam. Anaya Nicole Miles.
Eric Jahil Milan Luyando. Xavier Samuel Johnny Miller. Kari Lanice Mitchell. Gavin Landron Mitchell. Brandon Tavoice Moore Jr. Marquise Isaiah Moorer. <laughs> Josephine DeAngelis Moorfeld. Anaya Denise Morning. Landon Marquise Morris Grant. Anthony Michael Muller. Sanjay Nagar. Grace Elizabeth Neff. Isabella Mia Nieto. Micah Emmanuel Nixon. Dylan Francis Norris. Stephen O. Isaac Liam Olson Hernandez. Can I just say one thing? No. Oh. Oh, yeah, go ahead and go down. Go down. Lillian Faith Osuna. Connor Allen Owens. Leilani Abigail Pacheco. Sydney Rebecca Pallister. Is Anna Isabella Paparelli. Caroline Grace Paul. Camden James Peacock. Sarah Ann Peacock. Christopher Joseph Pierce, Jr. Christian Morris Perry. Sophie Grace Persinger. Ariana Shemise Pierce. Ashley Diane Pilger. Keontz Ovante Pressy Hall. Matthew Joseph Preston. J. 
Jalen DeAnthony Preisler. Joseph Carter Pruitt. Sanobar Hosheng Purveyor. Matthew Neil Race. Matthew Ryan Race. Emily Grace Radosta. Caitlin Elizabeth Rains. Chelsea Giselle Ramirez. Christian Andrew Ransom. Shikwa Rashidi. Shermone Anjante Rainer. Morgan Elizabeth Renninger. Miguel Aguirre Jordan Resto. Lillian Reese Ryan. Zara Nairi Rhodes. Oliver Ashley Richards. Lorena Morene Rivera's Hernandez. Chaz Wiley Roberts. <laughs> Nicholas Ackers Roberts. Connor James Robertson. Anna Larice Rochard. Aiden William Rochard. Jacob Thomas Rooks. Seth Andrew Ross. Craig Yakute Round. Vincent Anthony Ruda. Madison Lee Sabo. Allison Mariella Salazar Algarin. Joseph Michael Saldana. Cameron Stevens Scales. Elizabeth Ann Schmidt. Ale Kylie Alexis Scrag. Amaya Nicole Shazer. Christopher Alexander Sheldon. Trinity Danae Sibley. Rachel Ann Siegel.
Natalie Reese Sill. Cheyenne Manice Silverio. Amaya Leanne Sma. India Nicole Smith. Lindsay K. Smith. Ashley Owen Southers. Jonah Daniel St. Clair. Nathan John Starr. Owen David Starr. Sebastian Gabriel Steed. Jacob Paul Steep. Robert Earl Suloff the Fourth. Brennan Michael Sweeney. Landon Alexander Tate. Em Amelia Nicole Tambroska. Lonnie Rose Lanith Taylor. Kennedy Renee Thomas. Corey Lanaya Thompson. Zoe Faith Thompson. Emma Christine Timberg. William Robert Toth. Melody Ruth Turlington. Rodnasia Lene Tyler. Darielle Kylie Valencia. Nathaniel Xavier Vance. Aiden David Wabel. Madison Altali Wallbank. Kane Wilson Waller. Maggie Elizabeth Watson. Abigail Noel Weirs. Parker Mitchell Whalen. Whitney Blake Whitehurst. Cameron James Wilder. Lacey Marie Williams. Lanaya Cherie Williams. Nicholas Anthony Williams. Robert Andrew Wilson. 
Ramel Zaid Wilson. Martin Pavlin Yordanov. Jackson Scott Zahn. Dylan Jacob Ross. Lindsey K. Hood. Melinda Lindblom. Abigail Diana Pacheco. Jillian Maya Perdiconi. Marianne Louise Packer. Hannah Lee Butner. Samantha Hagen Parker. Chloe Shaylin Dalton. Kyleen Danelle Valencia. Haley Elizabeth Redden. Parents, families, distinguished guests, and all invited guests, on behalf of our Superintendent of Schools and the faculty and staff of War Hill High School, I proudly present the graduated class of 2022. Graduates, for those of you still with your caps, you may now move your tassels from the right to the left. <clears throat> we thank you for joining us in celebration today and wish each of you health, happiness, and success. We invite you now to witness the recession of this arena by the graduates. Seniors, please remember we will recess out together. Please remain standing until all graduates have left the hall. Have a safe and enjoyable summer.